And we've got the recon here, so let's go for scientists here as well. And move on. Make everyone into robots through mind control? I mean, pfft. obviously. Obviously. One or more enemy spies have entered our territory. Our intel indicates they plan to act in six, six days. You need to investigate their movements as soon as possible. So, uh, remember how we sent out our drones to do work for other people? Yeah, exactly. Sigma Activity United States. So, health, which we obviously know about because they developed that technology. Um, but also astrophysics. And um, that's cool. We're in robotics and neuroscientists. Or neurosciences. So, hopefully... Um, I mean, that, I guess that's good for us and bad for us. It's bad because... They don't have scientists that we could try to, like, uh, recruit. It's good because we're not competing in the same tree, but we'll see. This is very close to finishing. Very close to finishing. This is my wife. Uh, I have a favor to ask. We think a large corporation is dumping radioactive waste in the United Kingdom. Can you send a surveillance drone to check? Just a quick visit to take a few photos. This is a little bit of a problem because we got to send that drone uh, back to our place. Actually, maybe we don't. I think we can send an agent back to our place. I think we can send an agent back. Can you take the same scientists away from other nations that they currently have working on research? Because then you could slow down their progress. Yes. Yes, you could. Yeah. How's the new setup working for your neck? You constantly need to look to the side to talk to us. I actually really like it because uh, it, it gives me an opportunity to like look away from my screen every once in a while. Um, I also like that it's not you're, where people aren't just looking straight at my forehead. Julia, if that makes sense. I, I like the look better. Like, I could, I could come in a little closer. How's that? Is that okay? Yeah, we're still using the drone, exactly. So I, I, I don't know. Um, I don't know. I don't know, but we're going to find out. I'm going to tell her... Uh, I'm going to say yes, but if I don't do it, I don't do it, right? Got it. Happy wife, happy life, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Ecology is a major issue these days. Yes, it is. Okay. So, that automatically sends the drone. Didn't know that. Now we know. It means it's going to leave from there and go there. Uh, my country's counter espionage division has detected an enemy spy. If I do nothing, they can capture one of my scientists. The notice from my superiors tells me how many days I have left uh, until the spy takes action. This leaves me some time to repair. That's the, the log that we saw before. I need to send one of my agents to intercept them to prevent an enemy spy from being successful. I risk losing a scientist if I don't intervene. Okay. So we got to send somebody home. We don't need to send the drone, but we do need to send someone. It's unfortunate because we just found that there's like all these scientists here in America. But he's really, he's like our strongest, well, would any of these be better at this than the other? I'm looking for something that, I'm looking for something that would um, be more of a specialist in this area, but he's the only one available, so I'm just going to send him over. All right. Let's go back home. We have a few days. So he's in Moscow. Await your orders. We're 96% to this neurosciences. This is dope. Uh, I was able to penetrate the research facility, and I think I collected all the information we need, but they spotted me. So Germany alert level is a little bit higher. Germany is working on neurosciences and finance. Okay. Uh, mission accomplished. I was able to infiltrate the research facility, gathered all the actual intel I could find. Interesting. China... She didn't, she found, she said that she was successful, but no targets and no field of study. And then we've got more intel on Susan Morris, who's studying astrophysics. Now here's another group, Defense Robotics. So these guys want us to do work in robotics field, which we're already doing, obviously. So this is fine. And as we progress through there, they're going to help us. That seems cool. Okay, my agent's ready to intercept the spy. Click on their portrait to begin the operation. Here we go. So, uh, 
we'll routinely get spies in our own place. And I think having drones there helps with that. Um, but I don't know. So we need to identify the spy. Uh, locate them. Tell an agent to identify and locate the spy. We can use the this spy to intercept them. Let's go. He's got high intellect. Should be fine. Who knows? Might not be. Could backfire completely. How's everything going here? Two days remaining. Let me check our other um, groups here. So this is the guy. Uh, is he the one? Yeah. Hold on. Send your surveillance drone there for several days so we can gain precise information. Which we did. We did that, right? We'll see, we'll see how that goes. We'll see how it goes. Okay. Let's see. I kind of want to find... I want to find some scientists now. Let's go. In Germany, uh, we've identified some. We just need to now investigate. And here... <laughs> okay, guys. Here we go. Susan Morris. She's 29 years old. She is a woman. She has a preference for men. Okay? She has a preference for men. That's cool. She's flighty. Quickly drops their guard with an attractive person. Corruptible. Is aware that their knowledge could be worth a lot of money. And she's a charlatan. The scientist is not very competent despite their good reputation, which makes them less effective. Okay. Now, we're probably best to uh, seduce them. The challenge is, so she's into men, and that's, that's fine. But do you remember, we have that agent, uh, her, she's like the Miss Universe, literally. Um, she's a, like a super seducer. She would be somebody that would be awesome to use there if she was a dude. But she ain't. She ain't a dude. So that's unfortunate. Um, the other side of things, though, with uh, bribery, we have um, a good option here. Now, I don't know why, and somebody can feel free to add to this. Um... I don't know why I can't try a bribe here. It might be because my intellect is too low, but it doesn't tell me why I can't do it. Maybe my um, relationship with my own government isn't high enough. So I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, we're a seducer here too, though. We're a seduce. Everyone's a seducer, I think, except for like one person. So this is not bad. Oh, it's the honest trait. There it is. Yeah, okay, cool. This agent is highly scrupulous and less effective at bribery. Cool. Thank you. That's awesome. See, it's like little things like that where you've really got to know the traits of your people and like line them up with specific scientists in specific um, countries. Like it's deep, man. There's a lot going on here. Hey, Richie, what's up, buddy? How are you, man? King Quote, thanks for the six months, bro. Castle, thanks for the 17. Methandrew, thanks for the 15. Varenum. Thanks for gifting us up to Zivix. Chris B, thanks for the two months. And Pumpkinhead, I think I caught you before, but thank you so much. Okay, guys, we're gonna we're gonna seduce the hell out of her. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> okay, Maestro. Work your magic, big boy. Let's go. Oh, the thing is, <laughs> I mean, okay. She is, she's in astrophysics, which is not something we're currently developing, but that's fine. Um, it will definitely slow these guys down if we can seduce her. So I'm cool with that. Read the notification, thought we were playing Invisible Ink again? Not quite. I could see on like a description level, you could see that. Operation Chubby Kiss? Oh, you guys are rude. That is very, that is rude. Okay. Let's hope it works. My country, France, is currently undertaking a military operation in Libya. The support of your tactical drones could strengthen our relationship. Okay. Current progress with active... What is this? This is your current progress with active projects. So did these complete? Why are we down at zero? 
Relationship with defense robotics increased by 1%. A form of mental conditioning that results in an immediate and substantial increase in the intellectual power of an individual. Guys, this is good. This is good. <laughs> this is great. This is great news. Mentalis project is complete. We can keep this technology for ourselves and apply its benefits to our own field operations. However, Council of States, an influential group in neurosciences, is pushing for us to deliver the information to them so that they can make exclusive use of it. Any technologies developed will be theirs alone. Bro. Are you kidding me? Of course we keep it for ourselves. So here we go. We got a new agent. This is somebody that we can recruit in future playthroughs. And then lightning. By replacing tendons and skeletal muscle muscles with smart nanofibers, we can create soldiers with extraordinary reflexes and superhuman speed. <laughs> We're going mental. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, defensive robotics see this is where I'm not sure what to do because um, they said that if we helped them if we gave them any of our technology that they would help us in other areas but we don't know what like we don't know what that is exactly so I think for now we're just going to keep everything Metallus technology boosts the mental abilities of individuals' latent potential. With this in mind, we noted that two of our agents were eligible and carried out the operation. Shouldn't have to wait long to see these results. So Liberty and Magician gain super intelligence. That's what I was born with, in case anyone's wondering. Mentalis. That's what they called me in, in high school. Christopher Mentalis. Lightning Protocol. Uh, their reflexes are now superhumanly fast. I'm sure you'll find these of use on infiltrations. Guys, I can't... Honestly, I'm so pumped to show you ex, uh, infiltrations and exfiltrations. Super cool. Uh, but we'll get there in a sec. So three of our people got it. That's that's huge. Anti-capitalist brigades. Look at this guy. Surge. Serge. What are you looking for? What the hell? We want to destroy the capitalist system that has been the cause of hundreds of millions of deaths for decades. We'd like your help. If you help us, we'll be generous. But if you betray us, we'll kidnap one of your agents and deliver them to your enemies. Sweet. They'll be tortured and forced to reveal your most sensitive secrets. We have to infiltrate the financial markets to destabilize them. The American Sigma head has access to Wall Street. Investigate them. We're counting on you. Frick. Okay, well, I don't want to lose an agent. So... Where do these guys fall? Anti-capitalist brigades. So when it says investigate them, does that mean just send my drone? Or do I have to send somebody over there and do something? I'm not sure. Hey, Tobeman. Welcome, buddy. What's up, dude? How are you? Okay. Oh, right. Yeah. So I see what's going on here. So previously we were working towards this thing, which was uh, Mentalis and then the, the lightning thing. And now the icons changed to show that we're working on new stuff. Okay. Uh, Turkey military operation Yemen's complete. Your drones were very helpful. My government extends their thanks. So we improved our relations there. I guess that's good. Uh, we located a spy awaiting orders to take action. That's the guy that was in our home country. Uh, Morris is joining the Sigma division. From now on, they'll work as a double agent for us. And uh, I've got info that we uh, researched on this new scientist. So, double agents plus 0%. Let's see how that works. Bad news, I'm afraid. United States has completed the project codenamed Solar Network. We'll do our best to reverse engineer the results, which should accelerate our research, but it is sensible to conclude that these discoveries will be used against us. Renewable energy source that benefits everyone. Global transition to green economy has begun. While this is good news for mankind, it seems that our nation is at an end of the queue to be linked up. <laughs> so, I mean, our research will progress somewhat slower than our competitors for the foreseeable future. Cool. That's great. <laughs> nice to meet you too, Toban. 
Thanks for coming, dude. Okay. So Korea's abandoned the race for Sigma technology. They're gone. Don't have to do anything with Korea anymore. They're out of here. Uh, we've got the edge of Korea, and we would be, like to congratulate you. There might be scientists or research that we could exploit to our advantage. Uh, continue with your efforts. You're doing well. So, with that in mind, we should uh, we should go to Korea and investigate because we have no like diplomatic relations to worry about. We should go there and like snap these guys up ASAP. I think. Anyways, we got to take care of the the uh, the spy. This person named Judge. <laughs> cool. Uh, the agent will try to cause the operation to fail. In the event of success, the spy will have no choice but to flee the country. So we can try to counter, or we can try to capture. Um, if we counter, it uses strength or intellect, whatever is higher. If we capture, it uses intellect. Uh, because it's teaching us, we have to just pick counter. I think. The agent will try to capture the enemy spy, a more difficult operation which relies on their physical skills. Okay, so maybe we can choose either one. He's much better at intellect. Right? So we're going to go that route. And I don't know... Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, I'm, I'm actually wrong. I, I misread that. Uh, <laughs> I'm so shocked, eh? Like, oh, I'm actually wrong. I've never been wrong before. Agent will try to capture the spy. It uses intellect. Yeah, we're going to go with that. For sure. Also, let's take a look at this. So they undergone mentalist training to boost their intelligence. So he was what, like an eight before? Is it nine now? Cybernetic lightning, significant advantage in hand-to-hand. -hand. This is pretty useful coming up. Cool. Oh, he was a seven before. Even better. So does that super intelligence just bring them up to uh, like a maximum? Is nine the maximum? Or is it boost by two kind of thing? I'm going for a capture. Why not? Hey, Tobe, man. Thank you so much, buddy. Vile blood, welcome, dude. Oh, dude. That just reminded me so much of... Uh, of uh, What's the vampire game that's coming out? Vampire Masquerade Bloodlines 2? Try saying that 10 times fast. Exactly. Agent Maestro can proceed with the exfiltration of uh, Professor Morris. To do this, click the agent to display their file. Now, this is actually quite cool. The way that this has worked out. Because we have our recon drone here. And I think that's going to help us on the exfiltration. Okay. Do you want to exfiltrate? Yes. Buckle up. Hey, Asanderon, what's up, dude? I'm doing really good. How are you? Thank you. Thank you so much for coming. Okay. So now... It's almost like we've shifted into a completely different game here. Um, you're not going to be in, like control of the of the characters or anything but you're still making those dialogue styled choices to impact how your exfiltration goes all right don't think you can strap him into the drone <laughs> yeah probably not eh? okay so the aim of exfiltration is to support the agent in getting to a secure extraction point the more discreet the agent the less violence they use the greater the chance of success Okay. This is the level of alert at the top. The more discreet the agent, the less the authorities will pursue them and the fewer opponents they will encounter. This is the agent's weapons. A well-armed agent can take on a greater number of enemies. A poorly armed agent can always try to flee and stay hidden. We got hiccups, sorry. This shows if my drones can help the agent during a mission. And because we had... This is, this is kind of cool how this worked out. So, um... Remember when we had, uh, we got, uh, our wife came to us, Rami. I think her name was Rami. <laughs> can't, can't even remember my wife's name. Uh, and she was like, hey, can you put this, like, drone over here because of the, like, all this ecological stuff was happening? And now it's really great because it's here and we can, it's like, double utilization. Very efficient. Rami. Yeah, exactly. Rami. Yeah. Actually, it'd be cooler if it was Rami, because my wife's name is a Ram. It was just... It would have been more... Whatever. <laughs> we don't trust Rami? Come on! This shows my drones can help uh, the agent during a mission. A surveillance drone allows the agent to make the best decisions and perhaps avoid an armed, uh, any armed forces in the area. A combat drone can eliminate these forces, but will cause numerous casualties. 
If you have good relationships with a local armed group, it will be shown here. In case of an armed conflict, this group can be involved to cover my agent. So I guess that's where the um, those organizations that have been contacting us come into play. Click start to begin the exfiltration. Okay. Buckle up. This is the agent's health down here. Uh, if it reaches zero, they'll be captured. If it falls to zero during a gun battle, they will die. That's great. Good luck. <laughs> okay. Chat seems to think Ranny's a spy. It's Wonk and Joey. I mean, chat could be right. They've been right about a few things in the past. I don't know. I know this place. It's under control of the anti-capitalist brigades. Do you think I should ask them for help? So... Are we on good terms with them? I don't think so. We haven't really done anything with them. Um, they contacted us. They want us to do some stuff, but we haven't done anything with them. So we're just going to stick to our plan for now. Understood. The authorities patrol the edge of the ghetto. They'll have my description. Next. Our surveillance drone indicates that uh, you are nearing a patrol looking for you. Detour to the alternate route. So because we had this drone here, we were able to just slip by this group. If we didn't have the drone, we would probably have the option to either uh, fight them, try to sneak past, uh, depending on how big they are, how like many um, agents were there. We might uh, be able to take them down quietly or there's a bunch of different things that can happen. Can you buy more drones? Not that I know of, Bonnie. That's a good question though. Okay, just avoided a group of police. They didn't see me. I'm passing uh, their truck. There's only one driver inside and it should be full of weapons. Okay. So we have two options. Neutralize the driver and steal the vehicle or quietly steal a weapon. The thing is, like, we already have a weapon, so I'm not even sure why we would need that. The thing is, if we steal the vehicle, we could probably go faster. If we quietly steal a weapon, then we probably just go slower. Um, this guy has the driving thing. Yeah. He's a wheel man. We're going to steal it. Okay. And it was a strength check. We got a new agent. Driver neutralized and driving the truck and found a weapon. Zoom. I was trying to avoid patrols and I've all... Sorry, I've ended up on a road going away from the city. I can't see an easy place to turn back. Okay. Abandon the vehicle now and get back on route. Go, in, go back on the route. Stop driving in the op... Oh, get back on the route. Stop driving in the opposite direction. Hmm. I... Th hmm. Let's keep him in the vehicle. There we go. Kinda. <laughs> Crashed into two cars and I escaped. The police must be looking for my vehicle by now. So he took us some health damage there. But we still move 300 meters. We have uh, 1.4 kilometers left to get to where we need to go. I've avoided the police that were looking for me. Good. Oh, we're almost there. The roads are at a complete standstill and I can hear police sirens behind me. You don't have a choice. Drive onto the sidewalk. Or leave the vehicle. I think we leave the vehicle now. But we're a wheelman. Now nah, we're driving. Yeah, yeah. Cause of panic. I didn't knock anyone over, but the police definitely saw me. I'm continuing on the road. Sick. Cool, cool, cool. So, <laughs> we got this scientist out of the country. No big deal. No big deal. Leave. Oh, see? We're wheelman, though. So I think anytime we have a trait like that, we just hammer it. Uh, the United Kingdom. I can't prove it, but I know it was you and your agency behind this operation. You'll regret this, I assure you. We lost a little bit of... Uh, of um, diplomatic relations here, but... With our own, we improved pretty significantly. Super cool. I like these. These, these infiltrations, exfiltrations, super fun. Okay. So now you can see here we're flying back to to Russia. Uh, what are we doing in Germany? This guy. So he's in finance. 
Man, I really think... It, so the U.S. is ahead of us, okay? Let me take a look here for a second. Do we not identify any... Yeah, see... I wonder if we should try to get somebody from the U.S. because they're in the lead. Try to slow them down a little bit. <laughs> Russia doing dodgy stuff in the streets of London. Come on, what are you saying? The thing is with her, we don't have the recon there. I think it's him. Yeah. We could send him over to the U.S., She got that super intelligence. Okay, so it seems like it only boosted it by two. I think she what maybe I think she was a three. Maybe she was a bit lower even. She could go to the US too. And she's an exfiltration expert. It kind of depends on the scientist that's that's there, honestly. So I think we'll start with him. Start with him over there, try to find out more about the scientist, and then figure out who would maybe be the best to convince that scientist to come back. Um we may also want to get in touch with them or even try to hack them to like lower their uh, alert level. It'd be interesting. Hey, Chun, what's up, man? Uh, I missed the start of the game. What is the TLDR? Looks sick just from the 20 second announcement video. Uh, very quick TLDR, I guess, is that we are trying to recruit a bunch of scientists from other nations to join ours to complete this research. This is basically the, a research tree. We're trying to get uh, 15 um, research points. And then from there, things change. I don't, I've never gotten that far, so I have no idea. But there's a whole bunch of other things we need to manage, like our relationship with them, diplomats, so on and so forth. We have to exfiltrate people. We have to convince people to join us. It's like we have spies in our country. There's a lot of stuff that we need to manage. And when you look at this, it looks very simple. But there's a lot that's happening behind the scenes. There's a lot that's happening there. Uh, I think if we could actually afford to improve our relationship with France, I'm going to send to this war our uh, combat drone. And here, he's wary of men. He's flighty, drops the guard to an attractive person. I think we're going to seduce again, guys. <laughs> I think we just... I think we just do it. The thing I'm worried about... Is that... When we need to exfiltrate this person... Okay, we seduce them, we need to get them out. Is she going to be very good at that? You know? What country am I? We're Russia. Yeah. We could do recon. Um, which might make that... Might, might, might make that easier. So recon there first? Yeah, exactly. I don't know if another agent can exfiltrate. I don't think so. Um, but I could be wrong. Hey, Warlin, what's up, buddy? Thank you so much, dude. Uh, Skunkish as well. Thanks for the 15 months. Thank you, guys. Let's try the recon. <clears throat> we could send the drone too, yeah. Okay, we got that uh, we got that spy. China's alert level is ridiculous. We didn't get any intel either. Um My relationship with defense robotics increased by 1%. Okay, so that's good. It's just going up gradually. It's all right. Armed escort at the research center. I'd like to request permission to see Susan Morris again. I need to maintain our relationship. Really, Maestro? Fine. 
Maestro Gain's pacifist trait will be unavailable for three days. We've captured a spy. I can negotiate their release using diplomacy or I can interrogate them. To do this, place the cursor over my country to display their captured spies and then click on their portrait. Sick. <laughs> uh, North Bane, thank you so much, buddy. Uh, Ripley Dig Dug, thanks for the 19 months. Been a minute since I've been able to catch a stream. Bro, it's been like a week since I've streamed too. Glad to see you're doing well. This got, game kind of reminds me of a board game called Ideology. It's wicked fun. Oh, cool. I wish I played more board games, honestly. Conrad, thanks for the 26 months, bro. Thank you so much. So check this out. Uh... So she's a pacifist. That's all we know. This is the health of the captured spy. It's important that the spy remains alive if I want to return them to their country. They recover a little health each day. Hmm. This agent may refuse to carry out orders that they deem too brutal. <laughs> Holy... <laughs> we go from standard interrogation to waterboarding. Holy frick. Being a pacifist, though, I wonder if they would be more, uh, more ready to just, like, fold and, like, give us what we want, you know? This is the captured spy's willpower. The lower it is, the easier it will be to obtain information on them. It's already pretty low. Begin the interrogation. You had this info from the capture menu? Oh, okay. Seducer? <laughs> God. I don't know, like, I don't seem to have any other options. Like, uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know where these go. So I have no, I have no idea. I have no idea. I have no idea. I'm just going to do, I'm going to do a long interrogation. Oh, that was good. Uh, what what did this bar represent again? So this is health. Oh, her health went down significantly. Want to know about the German alert systems? Tell me about the German Sigma head. Oh yeah, willpower. Okay, I don't know why this went down so fast. Just from a long interrogation. Jesus, she's weak. Uh, tell me about the Sigma head. Compromising file obtained. Okay. Continue. Okay. So each one of these probably, okay. So each one of these probably takes off like a certain amount of health, depending on how like rigorous it is. Waterboarding, probably pretty intense. Uh, would drop her confidence, but also she'd be dead. So how do I just stop? Can I stop? I don't know. I guess maybe we just keep going. Let's do a standard interrogation. So now she's she's no willpower. Lost consciousness during the interrogation needs several days to recover. All right. Okay. See ya. Okay. Um, things aren't going so hot here in China. I really want to get over to the U.S. Is this the, uh, yeah. So <laughs> we asked our, we asked our agent to, uh, to seduce Morris, and now he's off. He's like, oh, I need to spend more time with her. And we're like, okay, great. Are we screwed? No pun intended. Can I bring my drone home? Guess not. It's still there for the wife. Um. Wait, what's going on here? Why can't I click on my guy here?
Do I have a... Do I have a bug? Do I have something, like, outstanding that you guys can see that I can't see? <laughs> I can't click on my... I can click on certain stuff, but I can't click on these dudes. Okay. Let me see if I can restart it. There we go. Okay, weird. At least it's quick. Okay. So, I'd like to get this guy over to the U.S. Uh, I'm going to send him now. Uh, let's infiltrate. Now, we're going to operate under the idea that we probably can't uh, exfiltrate with a different person. So, I am going to try to seduce and just see how this goes. Wait, why can't I do that? Oh, we're doing recon. My bad. My bad. My bad. I got you. I got you. It's getting heated in China. Um, I'm going to try to investigate this guy. And the reason I'm going to do this is because I'm going to try to make uh, an appointment with him. And then in that agenda, we'll try to reduce like their alert level and go from there. Okay. And let me bring this drone home now. Okay, let's go. Are you planning on doing the advanced part of Weed Inc.? I love the series, would love to see more. Yeah, I think uh, this weekend, actually, Ireland Rhythm. Uh, I think I'm going to stream it, if that's okay with you. Um, only because on YouTube, there's some... We had some problems with, like, the age restriction and stuff. One of the more... Uh, one or more enemy spies venture our territory. Frick! Need to investigate their movements as soon as possible. Okay. Um... We did find that this guy is compassionate. Okay. Thanks. Now, is this agent... He was gone for three days, right? So one day has passed. Two more days he'll be there. And then he can investigate that spy, hopefully, maybe, possibly. Let's investigate here more. Okay, he's paranoid as well. Mission complete. Throw a recon of the area. Great job. Uh-oh. Turkey got stability. Let's see. Sigma Division now flushed with cash. And I think you may find their scientists are suddenly impervious to bribery. Okay, that's fair. Uh, we won't be able to bribe any of the Turkey scientists. United States got Chameleon. And Chameleon can modify facial structures. Difficult to spot them now of their agents. So them infiltrating us to steal our scientists is easier for them. Harder for us to, to deal with. Okay. Let's seduce the man. She's Miss Universe. He will not be able to say no. He will not be able to say no. It's just not possible. I'm going to investigate one more time. And I'm going to set up a meeting here in China. May 15th. Yeah, sounds good. Let's roll. Let us do it. This guy should become available now. And now that he's here... Oh, what's this? The operation to approach the target scientist has been cancelled. The target has been removed by an enemy agent working for the United Kingdom? What? We'll resume operations in this country? Embezzlement. Okay. France military, so we proved our relationships there. Come on! What are the chances of that? At the exact moment that we want to take that guy, the UK's in there. They probably got some super seducers of their own. God damn it. One got there first, yeah, but like just, just in time. Come on, bro. Damn it. So, <laughs> that's cool. I love that. That's actually so cool. Wait, I have somebody that's good in the UK, don't I? This dude right here. He's good in the UK. Yeah, I knew that. Oh, but he's got an arrest warrant there. Okay. 
we can we can deal with that through diplomacy, I believe. We can. Um, I need to deal with this target first. So we need to identify, and then we'll figure out what we want to do. We have details on him. So I'm, I'm going to leave China until, until we get a little bit more, like, comfortable. And we said we wanted to go to Korea. Because Korea was out. And so hopefully we can do things easier there. I'm not exactly sure how that works, but we'll see. Maestro's busy with Susan Morris. <laughs> not anymore, he's not. Not anymore. We got him back. Okay, well, let's see if this person is uh, useful. Okay, we need to figure out some information on these scientists. And he has, uh, he's got established recon here, right? Yeah, sick. Okay. Are things starting to click for you guys now? Because, like, for me, now things are starting to, like, we're getting into the flow of it. And things are starting to click and make a little bit of sense. They're starting to make some sense, you know? None of our scientists have been stolen yet. That's good. This is coming in soon. 4 to 10, 2 to 5. And, like, here's the other thing. There's a lot of RNG, which I just wish we could see. I, I really wish we could see it. Because I don't really know what's going to happen there. What's the main point of the game? World peace? No. <laughs> well, no. We're trying to, like, research this Sigma technology, which is the culmination of all these other technologies. And uh, we have to do that by stealing other people's scientists, which is easier said than done. Okay, we're getting there. Robotics is happening. Able to collect some intel on the scientists, but I was detected. Great. One of my enemy spies enter our territory. Need to investigate their actions as soon as possible. Wait, is this a second one? I'm going to pass you over to the National Radio Station, which is prepared some questions for you in the Sigma Project. The whole country will be listening. We trust you to do us proud. You're Now you're on National Radio. People are listening. We don't understand Sigma at all. Or rather, we do understand one thing. Our lives are being turned upside down. There's talk of secret actions and kidnappings. And then we're told it's too complicated for us to be told the details. What do you say to that? <laughs> well, we don't say it's too complicated because we're going to be pissed. We don't say we're doomed. Failing to trust the government means playing into the hands of our enemies. It's like listening to Big Brother. Eee! Okay, so this was moved forward by two minutes. Remember, if this reaches zero, we die. Uh, relationship with your leadership decreased by 5%. That's not too bad. Could have went worse. <laughs> Lucky Jewel, what's up? How's it going? Hey, God, says... Uh, Chris Ferrat has a great look at room, kind of matches the game. Thanks. I appreciate that. This is, uh, th when Aram and I watch movies, this is where we watch movies. This is, this is this, this spot. Okay. We gotta do something about the alert level here. So. May Bonner. Let's, there's a, there's a couple things we could be doing. Okay, I ha we haven't even gone into hacking yet, and I'm going to show you hacking right now. This allows our agent to steal or destroy scientific data belonging to an enemy nation. You can choose a target from this map. The state of alert for the nation and their defensive technologies, as well as your geographic position of your hacker, all influence the chances of success. If the hacker is in your nation, they'll benefit from a full logistics infrastructure to make their work easier. But in the event of a failure, your target will know that you ordered the operation and will have diplomatic consequences. If the hacker is located in the target nation, which is this scenario, their geographic proximity will increase the chance of success. But in the event of failure, your agent may be physically traced and potentially captured. If the hacker is in a third country, their operation will be completely secret, but their remoteness and lack of specialist infrastructure will impact their effectiveness. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. So if we wanted to hack here, there's things that we can try to do. We can try to locate scientists through hacking. We can install uh, ransomware. And then it turns out, I haven't done this, but uh, what was explained to me is that you can install ransomware on their servers. Then you could contact them diplomatically and say, hey, if we remove that ransomware, what will you give us? 
which is pretty cool. Um, oh, you guys can't see this right now? Here, I'll show you. Here, so stealing Sigma data, uh, you can just straight up try to lower the alert level. Um, you can install ransomware and you can delete arrest warrants and locate scientists. Now, it looks like they have super high security the way that I read this. So I'm not sure what gauges are chances of, um, of success. I would like to lower the alert, right? That would be the ultimate goal because it's so high. Um, let's see what happens, right? What's, what's the worst that could happen? I'm sure we're going to find out like now. Okay. Okay, so we got a new agent unlocked. Cool. Got all the intel we need on this scientist. Willem Zwicker. Neurosciences. That's good. That's a target for us. That is great. Okay, we lost the spy, but we're still... They're still in the area. Okay. And look, we uh, finished a robotics thing. The learning combat AI is capable of making millions of decisions per minute or per second, managing a battlefield completely autonomously. Human generals may become obsolete. Okay, we're I think we're actually doing quite well, guys. I think we're actually doing quite well. I'm not I, I'm not giving to give this technology. I don't know why we would do that. I guess it depends on like where they're located and if we need to exfiltrate there and then we could have their help on those exfiltration missions. I don't know. Uh, integrates an autonomous AI into our drones, which will no longer need to be remotely piloted by humans. You'll be able to use them in your operations more often. United States did Geoforce. They're crushing it. All right, now we got a dude from Star Frontier. It's another organization. My position at the Sigma... At the head of Sigma's in jeopardy? Okay. We've left the Geoforce technology in the hands of our enemies. What do you want me to do? China is out. Significant lag behind the rest of the world. We've got an edge over them. Might be able to get scientists there. All right. <laughs> I mean, great timing for our meeting, isn't it? It's freaking fantastic timing. Wheelman will do it. Wheelman can do anything in a vehicle. Yeah, exactly. This meeting seems useless. Does it not? Compassionate and paranoid. Ask for help. I'm in a bad spot. I need your help. Talk to them about conspiracies and surveillance. All right, either one's good. What if China's out? Uh, does it matter? Because, like, the thing is, there's still an alert level to manage. So we could try to lower the alert level, I guess. Uh, we could take this opportunity to boost our, our own relationship with our own government. Boosting theirs doesn't seem to matter because they're gone, right? So I, I think reducing the alert level makes the most sense. What am I offering? <laughs> Future considerations probably, because there's, no, there, there's nothing. What if I give them access to my research? Does that even matter? Because they're gone, right? That's weird. I don't know what to do in this scenario. Generic person. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. <laughs> Generic person. That's good. Uh, I'm going to grant access to research. I'll say astrophysics. Okay. Okay. I think that's good. 
we could have said future too. I don't. I don't know. Uh, I'm. I'm not sure. I'm just guessing because. Uh... Oh, frick! We got two targets here right now, you guys. This is uh, not good. This is not good. I think I need to send someone else back. Um, this is the other scientist that we got. Misandrus, wary of men. He's into men, but he's wary of them. Go figure. Okay. Well, uh, I'm going to send you back. Must deal with a last minute emergency unavailable till tomorrow. <sighs> what the hell? Mistakes are stacking up. Government won't be able to fully support your actions if you continue making poor decisions. Seriously, I feel like we're doing pretty good. We got the hacking done in the United States. Plan to act in four. Yikes. So hold on. Uh, there's a third one. There's, we have three, <laughs> three spies right now. What? Okay, everybody, everybody back to Russia. Go. Back to Russia. Back to the motherland. Oh, this is the, uh, oh no, it's not. Never mind. That was the UK that stole a thing. So this person's from Turkey and has an allegiance to Turkey. This is the diplomat. This is the the turkey scientist. <laughs> uh, astrophysics. Wait, let's figure out what do we want. We still want somebody for neurobiology, right? Phys I mean, astrophysics is fine too. But somebody already got solar network. So w when we get to that, we would only get the one point, I think. Because we're reverse engineering and then we don't get the other benefit. Whereas, like, we're kind of crushing neurosciences. We should probably stick to that. Um, same thing here. Like, we're so far behind that we're only going to get, like, the residual research done. It's more about slowing the U.S. That's a good point. You know, I can, I can get behind that. I can get behind that. But maybe we can find more scientists and find uh, better better scientists that would actually make more sense. Let's do it. I'm like, <laughs> I'm slowly getting like more and more addicted. Able to infiltrate research Philly. Okay, so I don't know if we were continuing to s Oh, look at this. Wait, that scientist disappeared. Whoa, what happened there? I'm gonna try this again. I, I don't know if it's if it's like a finite amount or whatever. We are having a hell of a time with these guys. Charlie. One day. Well Okay. Delta. Three days. Wait, who's got the highest intellect here? Four. Five. Five. So Bravo is four days, so let's do that. And then she's a five. One day remaining. Yeah, I don't know about that. That ain't good. Can I put them both on the same person? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. So hold on a second. Let's check this. Okay, so Bravo, four days. Delta, three days. This Charlie, one day. I'm putting them all here. And see, I don't know if that's good or not. We'll see. What's up, Ripley? Charlie, are you the are you the spy or what, bro? Mission accomplished. Able to infiltrate the research facility. Gathered. Okay, we're not finding any targets there, so I'm thinking. Okay, 
I'm thinking Japan. See how Japan's in the lead and the US just fell significantly? I'm thinking Japan stealing the US's scientists. We got Hypnos, ability to redirect conversation, implant ideas in the minds of others. Hypnos project is complete. Keep this technology for ourselves and apply its benefits. Yeah, we're going to keep it. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised by how much more success you'll have convincing scientists to join your cause. Okay, magician and maestro. The wife's in Turkey. <laughs> why, would, why would you share the tech anyways? That's a good question. And I'm thinking that... Um, I'm thinking that there are probably... Well, first of all, once we reach that, that 15 out of 15, maybe then we start sharing some research because then we can utilize their uh, specialties in other nations. That's what I think. Because you're, you're not sharing it with, uh, with countries. You're sharing it with, um, with those uh, influential groups or whatever, or armed groups. Okay, guys. My wife's in Turkey. Local operative tried to kill her. Had to defend herself. They're dead. They're going to interrogate me. What should I do? Uh. Frick. Ask my superiors. So that's going to cut into this. I could maybe send an agent. All right. Oh, it just ran. It just go. It just sends one. Frick. All right. Interesting. That could be a complete disaster. <laughs> one of our agents have. Oh, whoops. Are we still not catching this spy? Like. I don't. That's really weird. So this is. Yeah, that Charlie spy is gone. But I don't know if they did anything. Huh. So we scanned for scientists here a couple of times. I don't know if that's a to complete waste of time. It might be. Persuade foreign scientists to work for my country. Um, I guess I'm going to go to Japan. Or we could still try to look at the, um, he's got the Korean thing, right? The Korean recon. I want to see if we can get scientists from these guys that leave, because it says we should take advantage of them. Or it's all ploy, could be. Absolutely. Spy was tailing, managed to lose me. Jesus, guys. Code red. Morris missed the last two mandatory check-ins and their current whereabouts are unknown. It's possible our scientist has defected to another nation or organization. Another spy is in. We demand you assign one of your agents to protect the area. Dude, I'm trying my best. We can't get any of these scientists or any of these spies. And they stole Susan. Son of a bitch. <sighs> Rip, Susan. Okay, five days. Five days. I think I should maybe... This guy could be at home. This guy with his super intelligence probably just capturing spies all day long. Honestly, like it's his job, which it will be soon. Soon just picks whatever looks best. <laughs> How is Borderlands 3? Good or rip? Uh, I go next week. Um, on the... I'm going on the 29th. I'll be back on the 1st. So, uh, yeah. I'll have a... I'll, be, I'll probably be able to put up a video of some kind. These guys were pissed that we weren't there. That's fine. I'm really surprised we're not finding... Oh, here. 
We are identifying. Okay, that's good at least. 